eight dollars and twenty nine cents for this this box of cereal. Can you believe it? Holy smolies! It's seven point seven ounces. Wow. Fifteen dollars and forty nine cents for um, one pint of avocado oil. Holy cow! If you want to chase your chickens down, let these guys do it. Organic. <laughs> it's organic pasture eggs. Seven ninety nine for a dozen. These are still high. When you can get the white eggs for two twenty nine. I'll pick the white eggs, but $7.99 still. It's ridiculous. Turkey hot dogs, $4.79 for a package. Holy cow! <laughs> $5.49 for this. For hot dogs, how many you get in here? What, you get six? <laughs> New York strip, $13.59 a pound. That's nuts! That's just the New York strip! Today is Friday, and uh, we're heading into Target. We're going to check some prices. I know inflation is going through the roof. The, our dollar is being devalued. We all know that. The media is not going to tell you anything like that. But uh, let's head in here. Let's check the prices. Let's have some fun. Well, the first thing I notice in Target when I walk in, the first thing is a case of water here. Look at this. Six, six twenty nine for this, this case of water here. Six dollars and twenty nine cents for 24 bottles. That's crazy. Let's check out some of the breads here and my wife likes this nature zone here. 349, 313 at Walmart for that. And there's yeah, she likes this butter bread. 3 349 for the butter bread here. Oh my gosh. And where's now where is the other bread I saw that it was look at this. Sandwich bread, 20 ounce, white for a buck 39. So here it is. A dollar thirty-nine for this white sandwich bread. I don't see anything wrong with this at all. That's actually a pretty good price. You know what? I'm gonna get me one. <laughs> I'm gonna try it out. So that's that's what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna put it in the basket. A buck thirty-nine. That's pretty good. Look at some of the Wonder Bread. Two eighty-nine. Arnold Whole Grain. Four twenty-nine. That's actually not too bad, but oh, new lower price for Pepperidge Farm. Three ninety-nine. <laughs> it's new lower. What are these? Muffins, $5.29. Killer Classics. Oh, there you go. <laughs> $5.29 for these guys. That's pricey. Bread here, $4.99. $5.69. $5.69. Oh, geez. Thomas English Muffins, $3.49. I just, uh, that's just way too much money. And of course, the Martins potato rolls here, uh, $4.29. $4.39. Yep, nothing's cheap. Martin's right here at 4 dollars My gosh. And right across the bread, I noticed they have Rayos here. <laughs> I made a little video on it, and um, you'll see that if you haven't seen it already, but I just saw the mayonnaise, and you know, this is ridiculous. Two, two eighty nine dollars for five ounces, which is this. I showed this before, two eighty nine. dollars That's crazy. And, and right here, four twenty nine. dollars I mean, come on. There's nothing to this four twenty nine. dollars Crazy with the mayonnaise. Four eighty nine for this. Five twenty nine for that. Just it's it's insane. Five sixty nine for this. You saw the prices at the Costco. You get something twice that big and two of them for under ten dollars. Let's check out the New York strip. Thirteen fifty nine a pound for a New York strip. That's ridiculous. That's insane. Crazy crazy prices. How much is this petite sirloin? Eight ninety nine a pound. Oh my gosh! But a New York strip for thirteen fifty nine a pound. New York strip thirteen fifty nine a pound. That's nuts. That's just a New York strip. What else do they have? Beef tenderloins twenty two fifty nine a pound. Filet mignon. This uh, that seems almost a little cheap from what I've seen. But you know, there's different cuts of that. So, what else do they have? T bones, eleven fifty nine. And here, what do we have? Another T bone, twelve fifty nine. Looks a little better. And stew meat, seven ninety nine a pound, just for little pieces of stew meat. Holy cow! What else do they have that I could look at? Thick cut sirloin, nine ninety nine a pound. Boneless cut pork loin chops, five thirty nine a pound. I paid a dollar ninety nine for the whole one at Costco, and I cut it up into pieces. Five thirty nine, six nineteen a pound for this little package. That little package, 
619 a pound. My gosh. Woohoo! That's the really high prices here. Super high. 619 a pound. This big one here. Oh, if you buy the bigger package, the value pack. It's a value pack. 499 a pound. Woo! Bone in pork chops. 479 a pound. Good and gather. Yep, these are these are half the price at Sam's or Costco. Well, that's what you get, but you know, you get two in here, you buy in bulk, you're gonna save a lot of money. Here's the Hebrew beef ranks, $5.49 for this little package. $5.49. $5.49 for this for hot dogs. How many you get in here? What you get six? <laughs> $5.99. $4.79 for the Nathans, ballparks $4.49, $4.19 for Oscar Myers. $4.19, $4.79 for turkey. Turkey, turkey, turkey. Oh, I can't even talk. Turkey hot dogs, $4.79 a pound. That's nuts. Holy smolies. Turkey hot dogs, $4.79 for a package. Holy cow. <laughs> $10.99 for this big package here. That's not big compared to Sam's. And this big package here, $8.59. You get double that for the same price at Sam's. Here is something I really like, these Clausens, and they really haven't changed much in price. These are just delicious. I love these Clausens. $4.99 for that. $4.99 for these guys. And they're really, really good. I like these. $8.49 for the big one, but they go a long way. They're delicious with sandwiches. Now, just your average hamburger, $6.69 a pound for ground round here. Our good and gather, all natural ground beef, $6.29 a pound, $6.29 a pound now. And what do you have here? $8.89 on sale for $8.19 a pound for one pound of this Laura's Lean Beef. Unbelievable. That's ridiculous. That's kind of crazy. That price, organic. Twin pack or oh, two pounds, thirteen twenty nine. I'd rather have that. Eight nineteen a pound for this for one pound. One pound, eight nineteen. Just, just crazy. Five eighty nine for the eighty twenty. My gosh, that's that's just pricey. I mean, I like buying it. It's uh, Sam's or Costco. It's just better when you buy it in the bigger. You know the packages that I buy, three or four one pound uh, packages, then freeze them. Just a better deal. And now they're chicken. Boneless, skinless chicken breast, $3.99 a pound. Chicken breast, $3.99. Then they have their chicken wings uh, reduced. Oh my gosh, I hate anything reduced. $3.39 a pound because it could be old, but chicken wings, $3.39 a pound here. Man, I tell you, pricey stuff, isn't it? And here's some boneless chicken breast here, $2.99 a pound. That's not too bad. That's almost and all the pastas right here, the Burla, a buck ninety-nine. It's a dollar eighty-four at um, at Walmart, but a buck ninety-nine for that. Buck ninety-nine for the Burlas. Three thirty-nine for that guy. Holy smolies! And then when you go over to the Good and Gather, I like this price: ninety-nine cents. Ninety-nine cents for linguini. That's a really good price. I could deal with that. This is how you have to shop. Ninety-nine cents. 99 cents for that. Dollar 99. Why? Oh, it's 32 ounces. There you go. So it's there. 99 cents, basically. 16 ounces, 99 cents. They're all 99 cents. That's how you have to shop. 85 cents for this. Oh, little ones. Elbow macaroni. Good price. Here's the Rails marinara, and I got 28 ounces for 8.99 at Costco. $8.99 is what I paid at Costco, and this is seven, and it was 28 ounces, and this is 24 ounces for $7.39, and it was delicious. Rayos, 124 ounce container, $7.39 here at Target. It was delicious though, <laughs> fantastic stuff. But do you want to pay $7.39 for just one jar here? I mean, it's not that, it's, it's good, but you know, not $8 good. Holy smolies! There's something else I think maybe good is some of this a buck fifty nine a dollar fifty nine it looks really good heart healthy no artificial colors flavors or preservatives and it really looks good this this isn't bad and you're talking one fourth the price look at this tomato basil pasta this looks great i like this that's a better price than than paying something like this 
That's really a lot of money. It's really crazy, isn't it? $739 for all these. Holy smolies! I was looking at the different oils they have here. Olive oil for that little one, $499, $749, $589. Bertoli $9.99, but what I like for high heat is avocado oil because it has a high heat point of 500 degrees, but it's $15.49. Holy cow! $15.49 for uh, one pint of avocado oil. Holy cow! I see the price of the vinegars here. This is just regular value, $0.69, cents, $2.49 for this vinegar here. And then I look at some of this stuff, brag, apple cider vinegar, $6.79. New lower price in $7.29. Holy cow, look at this, $6.79 for vinegar. Oh my gosh, that's, that's ridiculous. Oh, it's organic. Apple cider vinegar, organic. This is $6.79, new lower price. Holy smolies. <laughs> and it looks like a new high price on Pringles, $2.49. 249 249 249 for Pringles they've gone way up holy smolies 249 for Pringles that's ridiculous 15% off regular 319 271 that's for the bigger can oh my gosh 289 for the veggie chips but Pringles could you imagine that two dollars and 49 cents now for Pringles insane absolutely crazy that's inflation, that's nuts. Let's check some of the cereal prices here. Special K, sugar cinnamon, 8.29. Now that's that's a little crazy. Is it this one? 5.29, oh that's Raisin Bran right there. Special K cinnamon, 7.7 .7 ounces for 8.29, no way. That's it, 8.29 for this, oh my gosh. $8.29 for this this box of cereal. Can you believe it? Holy smolies, it's 7.7 .7 ounces. Wow. The, the little bags of M&Ms now. A little over a pound, $7.19. I love M&Ms. Peanut butter. I like the regular, the milk chocolate, $7.19. And with peanut, I like these guys on here, but $7.19 for just a little over a pound. A little pricey. Some of these protein bars, I like these, but $21.99 for Cliff Bars for this. Holy cow, that's really pricey. Cliff Bars, two, you get two bars per pack, $7.69, $8.49, $7.99, Duos, $8.49. Holy cow, $8.49 for Kind Thins. That's not very kind, the price, but look at the prices. Holy smolies! Here's some of the Z bars here, 18 of them, $14.99. So the littler boxes, 22.86. I don't know if it's, though it's, it's hard to tell. Everything's so mispriced here. I think it's these and then $14.99 for that. And the Z bars you get, well you get, what, you get six for this little thing for five, five forty nine. dollars Oh my gosh. <laughs> just the prices, just crazy. Now Gatorade here is a buck fifty nine. Walmart was a dollar seventy five. So Gatorade here, oh, it was one seventy nine. So it's on sale one seventy nine to one fifty nine. One fifty nine, crazy, isn't it? Well, then it'll go back to one seventy nine. It'll go back to it'll go to one ninety nine. Holy cow! Just crazy. And I always take these fishing with me when they when they used to be ninety nine cents. Now look at that ridiculous remember this texas toast when it used to be just about a buck a box 2.99 for this eight slices 11 ounces 3.99 for 13.5 ounces breadsticks 2.99 you get 10.5 ounces just for bread put a little bit of butter and garlic on it garlic powder 2.99 crazy stuff huh let's check some of the pizzas for shut the here 27 ounces this isn't too bad if i'm reading it right 529 why is that and then i see stuff down here that's 1079 and then 529 this isn't bad right here i'm impressed with that but this amy's kitchen is 929 let's let's check some other prices here let's check some of these guys banza 969 Amy's 969, 929, 699 on sale for this little tiny box, 14 ounces. K 
Killer Bee plant-based pizza, eleven dollars and fifty cents. Eight ninety-nine for that. <laughs> Even the little Totina pizza is not. <laughs> it's not safe from inflation. A dollar eighty-eight at Walmart. A dollar ninety-nine here, and it's ten point five ounces for that. A dollar ninety-nine. Absolutely insane, and it's tiny. Look at this. A dollar ninety-nine. I will have to say that I'm impressed that the eggs came down. Chicken hasn't, but the eggs have come down. 12 count of eggs, and look at how many they have. 2.99, 18 count, 3.39. I like it. I like it. 3.79 for brown eggs. 4.79 pasture raised. <laughs> I still don't know what that means. So they just chase the chickens down or what? But 6.49 for that. That's not a bad price. Uh, some cage-free eggs right there. Three, like I said, do they chase them down? Three ninety-nine. <laughs> Pasture is eighteen count, eight ninety-nine. Organic, range-free. They're still chasing them down. Five forty-nine. <laughs> I just find it funny. It's seven ninety-nine for these guys for twelve of them. If you want to chase your chickens down, let these guys do it. Organic. <laughs> it's organic. Pasture is seven ninety-nine for a dozen. These are still high. When you can get the white eggs for two twenty-nine. I'll pick the white eggs, but $7.99 still. It's ridiculous. Well, that concludes our uh, our shopping trip here to uh, Target. This was just a quick trip in here on a, on a Friday morning just to check out the prices, and, and I was really surprised that the Pringles $2.49 for a can. They just keep going up and up and up. And, and the chicken, the beef, the beef's really going up. Everything is going up because the dollar's going down, being devalued. So anyways, give me a thumbs up for like, don't forget to hit the subscribe button. Until next time, this is Scott with The Real Economy. We'll see ya.